Hello, hello everyone. It's Brenda with Reese by Busy Bees Custom Creations. How are you guys? Let's try this again. How's it going? <laughs> Anybody here? Say hello. Hello, everyone. All right, let's see. Nope. Hi guys, how's it going? Just have to find you on here so I can see your comments. How's it going? It's Monday. Monday, Monday, Monday. Whew. Here we go. Okay. Hello. Hello, everyone. All righty. So. When I was at my show this weekend, let me see, I had, um, I had taken that, um, big Santa or big snowman that I had made that we were, that we made yesterday. Hey, Barbara. Hey, Rhonda. Hey, Faye. Hey, Mary. Hey, Gail. So, um, a lady wanted a smaller one. So, um, a lot smaller one. <laughs> So I thought I would try to make it with this. This is um, from the Dollar Tree. It's just one of those, you know, little tinsel trees. So, um, hey Darlene, how's it going? Thank you so much. So I thought I would um, use one of these. And that's all it is, it's this little Dollar Tree thing. So I'm just gonna take the tinsel off of it and see if we can do this. Because she wanted one and this is this is about 10 inches. She wanted it about 12, about you know, 12 to 14 inches. But by the time we put the head on, um, it'll be that big. So I've never made one before. Hey Kathy, hey Mary Jane, hey Peggy, hey Dee, hey Tracy. So that's what we're gonna do. So we're gonna give it a shot and see what happens. I also have this little snowman head from the Dollar Tree. So we're gonna use that. Hey Nicole, how are you? So we're going to use that also. So let's get started. See how this works. Um, I tried to find the mesh from the Dollar Tree, but they didn't have it. So I have a partial roll of this white. So hopefully this is going to work. We shall see. Yes, thank you. Please share. I'm good, Karen. How are you? So what I'm going to do, this is, I think, um, six inch mesh. And so what we're going to do is we're going to do the same method, basically, as I do. Hey, Robin from Australia. Hey, Kim. How's it going? And I'm going to take a zip tie and zip tie it onto the frame. We will see how this works. Hello. Thank you so much. Yes, if you guys wouldn't mind sharing my my page, this video, thank you, much appreciated. If you don't already get live alerts, please type in live and you will get a message from my bot. Um, if you have to answer it, oh, no problem, Norma, you can always watch the replay. Okay, cut that off. Hello, Ryan. Hey, Susan. Hey, Deb. Okay, so. That's what we're going to do. Put it over here. Um, if you want information on my group, you can type in group. Okay, so what I did for the other thing, so we're going to try and do this. So we're just going to kind of do a little poof. And then um, it was pretty good, Mary. I ended up selling like 15 wreaths total. Um, so it was pretty good. Hey, Joy. Hey, Betty. So I'm just going to do little poofs like that. I'm not really measuring. 
So I went from the bottom to the top, and then I'm going to bring it back down to the bottom. And, you know, just little poofs. I'm going to take zip or my um, pipe cleaners. I cut them in half. And this was from the Dollar Tree. So, like I said, she wanted one that was smaller. So I thought I um, saw these at the Dollar Tree. So I'm like, hmm, I'm going to go and see if I can find one. So that's where I found it. Okay, so just little poofs, and I'm going to go back up to the top like that. And we're just going to keep going back and forth like so. Yeah, I found this at um, the Dollar Tree. Hey, Peggy. Hey, Tammy. Thank you for sharing. Thanks for typing that in, Gail. Ooh, tender. Yeah, it's cold here. Although it did get a little warmer today. And this is going to be a little harder to work with because it is so tiny to get my fingers in here. Um, hey, Sandy. Hey, Elaine. Hey, Antoinette. Yes, this is six inch mesh. So I thought we would give it a shot and see what it comes out like. Yeah, so I don't know. I've never made this before. Thank you, Annette. I appreciate it. How's it going? So, is everyone ready for Thanksgiving? So that's kind of all I did. Let's kind of just go back and forth, and then we will fluff them out a little bit. I have to cut more pipe cleaners, too. And I'm supposed to be going to Pittsburgh for the for Thanksgiving, so hopefully the weather won't um, get in the way of that. Because, you know, if the weather's bad up there, we're not going to drive to it. Hey, Amanda, how are you? Welcome, welcome. So we will see how this turns out. Like I said, I think it's going to be rough. Thanks, Linda, once it gets up here to get my fingers in there. So we will see how this works. Because I had that, you know, that big one, like I made um, over there. And um, she was like, oh, I need a smaller one, like a tabletop one. I'm like, well, I don't know if I'm going to be able to find one that size. And then I thought, well, I thought I remembered seeing these little trees at the Dollar Tree. Oh, no, you can see the... Oh, sorry. <laughs> sorry about that. <laughs> Thanks for telling me. Is that better? <laughs> I didn't even realize that. Thanks, Deb. <laughs> That's funny. Okay. So I'm just kind of, like I said, going back and forth. I hope I have enough mesh. I don't even have a whole roll. Hey, Susie, I am making a little um, Dollar Tree snowman. The face, this I got at the Dollar Tree also. Hey, Debbie, how are you? Good to see you. I'm glad you're out of the hospital. How are you feeling? I was talking to Madeline to ask how you were doing. Muriel from Montreal. It's okay in Pittsburgh right now. Well, hopefully it'll stay that way. Because, you know, going through those mountains. Hey, Kathy. How's it going? You have 40 people? Wow. Hey, Sherry from New Jersey. Thank you for sharing, Pamela. That's a lot of people coming. How many turkeys do you have to cook for 40 people? That is a lot. Oh, I'm so glad you're finally out of the hospital, Debbie. Um, this is just, it's a little like, um, let me see, I'd say about nine inch frame that I found at the dollar store. And because this lady wanted a small like tabletop version. Um, 
I found this at the dollar store, Kay. It was just a little, one of those little tinsel trees. And so I thought we would give it a shot. Thank you for sharing. Hello from San Antonio. Welcome, welcome. Yeah, so I think it's going to be fine, but like I said, we will see how it turns out. I'm going to have to cut some more pipe cleaners. Maybe once I get up there, I'll have to use zip ties because, oh, 420, wow, 420 pound turkeys and four hams. That is a lot. I sure hope you have help cooking, Darlene. That is a load. That is a lot of people. <laughs> Holy cow. You guys pray for Stephen. I heard from Stephen today. I know, right? Hey, Lou. Um, Stephen had those shots in his neck and they did not work. So he has to get another shot and hopefully that will work. Um, so if you guys can just remember to pray for Stephen and pray for Debbie. She was just in the hospital for like 50 days. So pray that everything goes well with, um, with Debbie too. It was good, Kathy. I sold about 15 wreaths and then, um, you know, a bunch of little, a bunch of little, like of those, um, Ribbon angels and those ribbon flowers. So it went pretty well. So I'm just going to cut these pipe cleaners at around four inches. So it makes it a little smaller. But we will see how this works. Yeah, it was actually a pretty good show, relatively speaking. I mean, I've, you know, been to some that you just don't sell anything, but hopefully this black frame won't show too much. Yeah, it was, it was, it was okay. I mean, I was pretty happy with it, so. Hello, Joy from Michigan. Welcome. Thank you. Yes, we need to, you know, pray for Stephen and for Debbie because that's it's crazy. And my husband just had an injection in. Oh, wow, Darlene. We'll be praying for you, too. Darlene had open heart surgery five months ago. Where'd my pipe cleaner go? Hey, Angie, how are you? Like I said, if you're new to my page and um, don't get alerts, type in live and you will get an alert. And then you have to answer the questions. The glue gun I actually got off of Amazon. Let me show you. have an affiliate link for it so if you're interested in that just follow that link I know I should have spray painted but um, it's just a plastic frame from the Dollar Tree I think by the time we get all this on here it won't you won't see it as much but um, I should have spray painted it but I wanted to show you guys what it looked like from start to finish so, hey, Kathy, how are you? Okay, so we're getting into that row. <clears throat> oh, sure, Carl. I just made that um, on a Zoom call with a bunch of people on... Sunday, yesterday, um, 
I think I got this at either Joann's or Michael's, Deb, the six inch mesh. I was looking for it at the Dollar Tree and they didn't have it because a lot of times they have it, but um, they didn't have any. So this is, oops, this is the snowman that we made. I don't know if you guys can see it on um, Sunday. So if you guys are interested in the tutorial for that, um, just let me know. It would be $10. I found this frame at the Dollar Tree. It's a little one of those tinsel trees. And I had a customer who wanted a smaller little snowman. So I thought um, we would give it a try. Hey, Stacy from Maryland. Welcome. I'm glad you found me. Um, Jerry Lynn, a Zoom call is, it's like a video conferencing call where, hey, Shauna, welcome, where I can see you and you can see me. Like right now, you guys just see me and I just see your names and a little, um, a little picture. So um, thanks, Carl. Um, so that kind of lets us both see each other and talk to each other at the same time. So we made that yesterday. Yeah, it took three hours to make. So it was a long Zoom call. <laughs> Welcome, Stacy. I'm glad you found me. If this is your first time and want to receive live alerts, just type in live and make sure you answer the questions. Hey, Dee. Welcome. I know, right? That's true. So, um, yeah, we did that. Yeah, so type in live alert, and then if I have a group that's $14.99 a month, if you'd like to join that group, just type group in, and that will, um, hello from Scotland, welcome Suzanne, hey Leslie, hey Linda, um, that'll give you information on my group as well. Hello, Kusira, that's a pretty name. Hey, BJ, how are you? Hello, Eileen. Welcome. I'm so glad you guys found me. Okay, so it's looking cute. Go down and up one more time, and then we will move to the next tier and see how that goes. Yep, type in live, and like I said, if you want information on my group, type in group. Oh, no problem, Shauna. Yep, the replays are always on my page. So they will be there. You just have to go under videos and look. Hey, Joyce. Hey, Regina. I know, boy, that weekend went fast, didn't it? Whew. Okay, so I'm going to end at the top right there. Put that pipe cleaner in. Now, this is, like I said, this is going to be interesting trying to get inside there because it gets really tiny. Well, thank you so much, Lisa. Yes, if you guys wouldn't mind sharing this video, it would be much appreciated. Okay, so that's just the little bottom layer. So I think it looks really cute, right? So now we have to do next layer and we kind of want it to look like a snowman and boy I hope I don't run out of this because I don't have any more I will have to go back and finish it if we do this is a frame I got from the Dollar Tree it's just one of those little um, tinsel trees hey Kathy Hello, Teresa from Lancaster, Pennsylvania. I'm about an hour from there. Hey, Barbara. Okay. So then what I do is I just go up and down. So then I'm going to go down. And you want to try and find between where you put those pipe cleaners. And stick another little pipe cleaner in there. Barbara from Lafayette, Georgia. Let's see if I can get this in here. I thought I had rolls of white. 
more than this one. And then when I looked, it was silver and white. And I thought, well, that won't look right. So I thought I would have enough, but you know what? I might not have enough to finish this. Hey, Stephen, there he is. I was just telling everyone to pray for you, Stephen. Thank you, D. I was just telling everyone about you. <clears throat> Let's see. We can use that one. Oh. That pipe cleaner is too tiny. We'll see. It's going to get tight in there. <laughs> I was hoping I would have enough, you guys. I don't know. I don't think I'm going to have enough weight to finish this. Because I'm telling you, I looked today and they didn't have any. And I thought, oh, I have this one roll. I might have to finish it tomorrow. Yeah, the, um, the big snowman, it takes a lot of time and a lot of material. So, and this is so teeny tiny, this is hard to get your fingers in there. But we'll see. No, I am not going to have enough to finish this. Oh, darn. Well, we'll see. We will see. Yeah, this was just one of those tinsel trees from the Dollar, Dollar Tree, and it had this tinsel on it. So I just took it off. And um, I know, right? I hate that, Beth. Hey, Terry. Oh, awesome. I know. That's right. This is the time to ask for those things we want, right? Yeah, I do like that glue gun. Okay, so looks cute though, right? Hey, Linda, welcome. Welcome, welcome, welcome. Although I do have some little pieces over here. I wonder if we could, if we could figure it out. Let's see. We might, we might, I don't know. Look at my mouth. Hey, Jackie. Oh, it's tight in there. <laughs> yes, I am, Sandy. Yep. Making a mini little, little snowman. Hey, Julie from Utah. Welcome. I can't get my fingers in there. <laughs> so I'm going to have to do it this way and then tuck them under. We shall see. Oh, Linda, you know what? It's funny that you say that because my husband was just in here the other day. And he was like, you can cram more stuff into a tiny little space than anyone I've ever seen. <laughs> I'm like, I know. I cram it in there, that's for sure. And I'm always reorganizing it, too. You know, I'm always m moving things around and... Um, adjusting things and hey Nancy how are you hey Deborah welcome yes I do have needle nose pliers yep yeah so I might have enough because I have some pieces cut over here maybe I'll just finagle them into um, the top layer we'll see Mm -hmm. 
The tree form came from Dollar Tree. Sorry about that, guys. I know. I think it's going to be cute. Hey, Sandra. How are you? I am in Pennsylvania. So it wasn't too bad today. It was um, almost 50 this afternoon. So it wasn't too bad here earlier. But it's supposed to get cold and stay cold. So we'll see. Oh, thanks, Sandy. Yeah, you know what? Like I said, I saw a friend of, or um, a customer at the craft show wanted a smaller version of that snowman. And I was like, where can I find a teeny tiny little tree? And I thought I remembered seeing these at, um, at the Dollar Tree. So I went today and they have all different colors. So, excuse me, I'm going to take this off. Um, yours doesn't have anything? Oh. Yeah, they had all kinds of these. <laughs> no, Rosie, you need our cold weather. We're tired of it here. Thank you very much. You need it there for a little bit. Hey, Sue Ann from Washington State. How are you doing? Oh, where's Bartonsville? I'm not sure where that is. I think we might have enough to do this. And then, hey, Nick, welcome. Hey, Rose, how's it going? Yeah, we might have enough. How are you, Nick? Everybody say hi to Nick. <laughs> yeah, Rosie, I'm sending it to you. Thanks, Jane, I appreciate it. I think he's going to turn out cute. What do you guys think? And you can actually use this and use green and make a little tree. Um, you know, you can do this for anything and then decorate it with the little snow, with the little, um, it's a, it's just a plastic tree frame from the Dollar Tree. So giving it a shot and see how it works. I know. I think it's going to turn out really cute. If I can get my fingers in there. Thanks for watching, Nick. But yeah, don't forget to share this if you guys would. And also, if you don't already get live alerts, type in live. And um, if you want information on my group, just type in group. Yeah, I think this is going to work. And then I, I do have little pieces. That I think will make work on the top. So we're going to make it work one way or another. We can do this. Hey, Gail. I'm doing poofs. Well, I'm kind of poofs, bubbles, you know, a little bit. Hey, Gail. Hey, Valerie. No problem. You can always watch the replay. Share it with your family and friends, and then it will be on your page. Oh, sorry, getting a phone call. Okay, I think that I think we're gonna do it. I think we're gonna do it. It will work. All right. So I'm just gonna find that center bar there. And tie this one off. My show is good, thank you. I um, sold about 15 of them, which I'm happy with. Hey, PK. Um, thanks, Carmel. This is a um, Dollar Tree, one of those little um, glitter trees, little from there, the tinsel trees. And I just took it off, and I'm making a little snowman. So, all right, I'm going to cut that off Whoops. and tuck that under. This is six inch mesh. Okay. And then we're going to put this little head on there. I think it's going to look adorable. I think it'll be great. All right. So now since I ran out of that roll, I had some that were already cut on there. 
So we're going to make it work. Hey, Johnny, how are you? We're making a mini snowman. All right, we are just going to make it work. I guess I had these cut for another project, and they're cut to eight inches. So we're just going to make it work. So I'm going to take them, put a pipe cleaner around them. them off. And we're going to make it work. Hey, Jane from Rainy, Alabama. <clears throat> and then just kind of make a little poof on the top. Now, I think what I'm going to do for this I don't know, I'm just winging this. Is I'm going to use a, a twist tie. And I think what I'm going to do is I'm going to feed these into the twist tie. I think that's what I'm going to do. I'm going to wait till the end to do that and see how that works. So I'm just going to gather it like that. Whoop. Put pipe cleaner on it. Um, the form is just a little, it's a plastic form from the Dollar Tree. Okay. Let me get my fingers in there. Hey, Judy, how are you? Yep, don't forget to share this video if you guys would. And like and follow my page. I think that's going to work. Okay, we're just going to put some there, like a couple of them on the top. And then, hey, Janet, how are you? So I'm just gathering it like that. And then putting a pipe cleaner around it. Georgia, how are you? Oh, sorry, Georgie. Okay. Kind of sticking them through there so I can get it on there. Hey, Mavis, how are you? Okay. That's going to work, and then I will feed them all through on there. That'll work. That'll work. I am making a little snowman, Janet. Hey, Kathy, how are you? It will work. We'll make it work. Hi, Gail. No, I'm not. I am um, actually going to Pittsburgh. To, my mother-in-law is in a nursing home out there, so um, my husband and I are going to travel there on Wednesday to see her. So then we're going to go to um, my sister-in-law's house. I am making a little snowman out of this little Dollar Tree frame. Yes, yeah, see, and then we'll gather it all like this. Make little poofs and then cut that off. Yep, that's going to work great. It's going to work. It's going to work. See, you just have to be creative. Okay, let me cut a couple more of these. And I'm just cutting these to four inches and using it that way. Thank you. Yeah, it's about a five-hour drive, so it's not too, too bad, but you just got to watch going through the mountains, because if the, if you get snow through, oops, I need, well, um, if you get snow through the mountains, it can be crazy. It can be like sunny and bright and no problems on this side of the tunnel, and then you go through those tunnels and, you know, snow. 
So you just have to watch. You always have to watch the weather when we go up there. So I'm just feeding it on that center tie and then just tying it off. It's gonna work, it's gonna work, it's gonna work. Yep, and we'll just kind of poof those out and feed them through. Yeah, the snow, I'm just, ugh, I'm over it. <laughs> We've only had one, one snowstorm so far, but I'm over it. Okay. I'm just going to find that cross piece and feed it through there. Tie it off. Get my fingers in there. It's not cooperating. There we go. This mesh is um, six inches long, six inches wide. A truck full of corn? Oh boy. Oh no, Darlene. Hey Deborah, welcome. So I'm just gonna tuck those frayed edges underneath there. And then what I'm gonna do is I'm going to take a kind of smush them down. I'm gonna try and kind of make little poofs out of them. So what I'm going to do is I'm just going to take these and make little poofs and try to hold them all and then stick them through a, um, zip tie. And we'll see how it works. Okay. So. Poofier. Okay. Oh no, Trixie. All right, so I'm just going to take this zip tie and put it around those. And we will see how this works. I'm not going to do it tight yet. Kind of pull the poofs out a little bit. All right, I think that's gonna work, definitely. Okay, so I'm not gonna do that tight because I wanna do, and I'll cut those all off in a second. So what I did was I got this little snowman head from the Dollar Tree, and I'm going to take this little, hey Deborah, um, price tag off. And what I do is, you see how that always looks kind of white there? So then I take a black magic marker, Hey Venus, good. And I kind of just color that in so then you can't see. See, so now you can't see that there was a little hole there. All right. And then what I'm going to do is I have this stick left over from, I don't remember what I had it left over from, but I thought we're going to stick it in here. Let me get my little ice pick. We're going to ice pick right here and put this stick in kind of find the middle of it. So I'm going to put that in there. Hey, Sandy. Hey, BJ Betty. Okay, and then I'm going to kind of measure this. Let's see, I can always cut it shorter if I need to. And then cut that stick off. Whoops. And then I am going to take my little glue gun here and fill that hole up with glue and stick this right in there, okay? So then that's gonna be nice and tight in there. And then what I'm going to do is stick this, let's see what I can do here, in, down in there. And then we'll have to cut that off. Cut all those off. So let me tighten this up.
Okay, so tighten that up. And then we'll have to make them a little scarf or something so that all this mess doesn't show. I'm just going to take this and cut off all that extra stuff. And then we'll make them a little scarf and then we'll know. No one will even see that. See? Okay. So, what do you think? Cute so far, right? I think so. Like I said, those ones that were... I'm going to tuck those in there so you're not even going to see them. All right, so then we need to make them a little scarf. I think he's cute so far. Like I said, we just have to work on these poofs a little bit. The snowman head came from the Dollar Tree. I'm just gonna pull that out and poof it a little more. Okay, so now I have See if I have one and a half inch. I have two and a half inch like this. Let's try this. It might be kind of thick, but we'll see if we like it. And we will make a little scarf. If not, we can always cut it. Yeah, I found, I found him, um, I found the tree frame and the head from the um, Dollar Tree. So I think he's going to be cute. Let me turn him around. Let's do that. Kind of find the thing that looks the best. All right. So then I'm just going to take this ribbon and if I need to I will do one and a half inch but I think we'll be okay and then just kind of make a scarf out of it The body is, um, it's one of those little plastic tree frames from the Dollar Tree. So I think what I'm going to do is I'm going to take this ribbon and I'm going to kind of fold it in like that maybe and glue it in. Okay. Just going to kind of fold it over a little bit. Hold that there. Okay, and then do the same thing on this side. There's always a way. Okay, take that and fold it in. Don't burn yourself. Um, this ribbon came from Lion Ribbon. Okay. Hold that in. Okay. And you just make a little scarf. See that? That works. I got it from Amazon. Um, B Earlier, um, earlier up on the post, I put a link to it so you can see it there. I have an affiliate link. So then I think what I'll even do is maybe make little, like, you know, end of a scarf. Like that. Get that little piece. 
just off of there. All these little pieces here. Can't cut that off. And then cut the fringes. Make it kind of look like little fringes on the end. Okay. All right, so then we're just going to take it and wrap it around like that. All right, so get my little glue out here. Hold that on there. The body is made from a um, whew, from a tree form from the Dollar Tree. Okay, glue that there. That's going to work. And then glue that here. And then just hold it on there. I'm going to make this side a little shorter. Make those little things. Oh, thanks, Dawn. Yeah, I thought it was cute. I thought, you know what? I'm going to find a way to do this. And I think it turned out cute. Then what we need to do is I have some little black, you know, those balls that I use on everything. <laughs> I'm going to use them again. So I'm just going to take these little styrofoam jar fillers. Remember these? I use these in a lot of stuff. Let me see if I can find three of the bigger ones. Here we are. Okay, put those there so I don't lose them. Okay, then I'm going to... See, I also made them little hands, but I'm not sure. Thought I would kind of glue them on, but I'm not sure about those yet. So we'll start with these. Okay, I'm just going to kind of eyeball where I want that. I think I want that one right there. I'm just going to hold it on there. Oh, thanks, Dawn. And just kind of make sure that stays there. Yeah, I think this has turned out really cute. All right, take another one. Now I'm going to do this down the bottom and then I will put one in the middle. So I'm going to put that one right there. And then, um, hey Teresa, I'm good, how are you? Then I'll put the other one right in the middle of those two. This one right in the middle. Right there. Yeah, right, Rosie? Yeah, and it's pretty easy. I mean, it's a little tough getting in there, but um, I think he turned out pretty cute. I don't think I'm going to add the hand. 
but what do you guys think, huh? Hey, Sarah, how are you? I think you turned out pretty cute. Hey, Kay. Not bad. The glue gun I got from Amazon. I will show you right here. There you go. <laughs> oh boy. Yeah, I think he turned out cute, right? Just tuck those little ones in there. I know, I think he turned out adorable. Yeah. I like him. I like him, I like him, I like him. Yeah, so that's my little snowman. Thought I would give it a shot and see how it see how it turns out. But I thought he turned out cute. And you know, he can make the poofs bigger if you want to, but I like it. I like it, I like it, I like it. I'm trying to think if I need to move the head down, but I think it's cute. I know. I was I made him little hands. Um and I'm kind of, but I don't know if I like them or not. So I kind of have to come up with another idea for the hands. Oh, thanks, Sandy. Because I just like cut um, some pieces out of a little felt. But I'm not sure I like these hands. So I have to come up with another idea. Oh, thanks, Donna, for the hands. Maybe little sticks or something. I don't know. We'll see. I don't have anything right now, but um, I have to come up with something. Yeah, little sticks. Huh, I have to look for them. But yeah, I think he turned out cute. Yeah, it needs some arms though, but I do. I need to find some little sticks or something to um, make for the, for the arms. But I think he turned out good. Right? And you can use these little trees. Yeah, little twigs. Um... You can use these little, you can, you know, do anything. Just kind of something a little different. Yeah, I know. I'm thinking the head needs to move down a little bit. Whoops. Kind of um, down here. Just trying to think about it. I'll tweak him. Pipe cleaners. That's a good idea. Put little pipe clean. Oh, that's a cute idea. Hold on. Now that gave me an idea. I wonder if I use brown pipe cleaners. Hold on. Like they look like um, twi a little twig. Yeah, I think he turned out cute for the first time. Yes, yep. Okay, so let's see. Cut the arm and then cut little pieces. As little twigs here. Hmm. Not bad for my first try. I don't really like the way the head is, but that's okay. That would be cute. Well, if they're twigs, then they should be brown, right? Let's just see how this looks. Mm -hmm. Oh, I like that. It's cute. Yeah, I'm debating if I should put the little, um, you know, I 
<laughs> yeah, they make brown pipe cleaners. Yep, look. Look, isn't that cute? I like it with the little stick arms. I think that turned out cute. Yeah, I think I need to move the head down, though. That's the only thing. I think I need to move his head down. But, hey, for my first attempt, not too bad. I think he's cute with the little arms. But I think the head needs to come down a little bit. But I think he turned out cute. You know, I just need to tweak him a little bit. Move the head down, I think. I know. Don't worry about it, Kathy. No biggie. I kind of like the stick arms because it makes them look, you know. Because right, these little twigs turned out cute. I think I just need to move the head down, like maybe move the head down to here or something. And then it would look, I think that would look a little better. Hey, you got it. Yeah, or make a fatter scarf. Yeah, you just kind of got to work with it. If you don't like it, you start again. That's the beauty of wreath making and crafting. You, um, yeah, I think I'm definitely going to do that. I know. Don't you love those arms? I love the twig arms. Yeah, I think I just need to move that head down and um, work with that. But. Yeah, it's a little whimsical snowman. I think he's cute. Yeah, I'll just work on that head. Yeah, it will be more proportional when I move the head down. Yeah, I don't like the head sticking up like that, but definitely have to work on it. Let's see, I can get that out. I know I got to cut the scarf off, though. But we can do it. But yeah, I think he's cute. Move the head, change the scarf. It'll look cute. You can't see the arms. It's kind of hard to see it. Let me see if I hold it up like this. Kind of see the arms sticking out. <laughs> yeah, I need to move the head down, but I think it'll be cute. <laughs> He's cute. <laughs> oh, that would be cute stuff. Yeah, like a little baby snowman. Yep. Cute. I didn't put lights on it because I didn't know if I could fit lights on it. Like I said, this was just an idea I had. So I thought, well, let me try it and see how he turns out. And I'll tweak it a little bit and um, we'll, we'll go back. And um, yeah, maybe. Yeah, I like it though. I think it turned out really cute. You know, you got to try things. If they don't work, you try it again. But I like this little stick for arms. Yep, we just got to work on the head a little bit. All right, guys, that's it for me. Thanks for watching. I hope you guys like it. Um, yeah, he's not bad. Not from the first try. You just have to tweak him a little bit. <laughs> oh, yeah, I bet the star foam cones would work. Yep. Yep, absolutely. You know what look cute with those, Deb? Put little um, pom-poms, little pom-poms on them. That would be cute. Like a little pom-pom snowman. That would be adorable, Deb. Okay, guys, that's it for me. Have a good one. Thanks for watching. I will talk to you guys later. Have a wonderful Thanksgiving. And I will see you, at, you guys in my group tomorrow night at 7 p.m. And we will go from there. Have a great one, guys. Bye.